Hey there everybody, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play to Sky F5 Complete. Now, just to briefly catch you up, a tomb's now level 70, I've unlocked the Sage, I transcended uh, Dracula one more time, he is now a Blaze Ritter, he is ridiculously overpowered, as you can see his stats. Uh, <laughs> this, is why, this is why reincarnation's absolutely ridiculous, guys. You reincarnate one or two times and your stats just fly through the roof there. But... I also made the Sage. She doesn't actually have access to the crazy ability that I want. It's called Land Decimator. That ability hits everybody on the screen at the same time. I mean, not, is it an ability or is it a skill? One of the two. But it hits everything on the screen at the same time. And it's absolutely amazing. But she doesn't get that till 150, so <laughs> kind of pointless right now. But yeah, everybody's ridiculously strong. I'm have uh, some of the monsters do? in one of the squads that lets them gain EXP even without being in battle. But, I digress, we are heading to Scorching Flame. Finally, after, you know, hearing Red Magnus just preach about how powerful the demons are here, we finally get to go so here. This is Scorching Flame. Looks like it's been wrecked pretty bad. It looks terrible, Flip. I can't even tell what it used to look like. I can't believe some imbecile could have been taking a nap while all of this destruction was happening. Shut your mouth! Let's just find that magical spear and destroy it! Yeah, that's what I intend to do. But doesn't look like that's gonna be easy. The Lost are here! The newly coronated Overlord Zorokin will take care of you! I was wondering who was out here. So it's you, Red Magnus. It's been a while. Red Magnus, you have friends among the lost, Flip? No, can't be. It is I, Ponchos. But Ponchos? Come on, don't tell me you forgot all of us who worked so hard for this netherworld. That means... Are the lost soldiers that are here Red Magnus' underlings that he thought were dead? My, is that so? No wonder they look all filthy and sweaty. You guys! You're alive?! Damn it! If you guys were alive, why didn't you all come straight to me?! Ha 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 ha! You're pretty optimistic. Kill him. Whoa! But hey! What do you think you guys are doing? Don't you get it? You're part of the Lost now. No one here works for you anymore. We're all members of the Lost Army, under orders to eliminate the rebels. Anchos, you! If this is all a joke, you're taking it too far! This netherworld was destroyed, but you haven't changed one bit. Well, since it's you, we don't mind taking all of our hatred that's built up over the years out on you. We get to beat the crap out of you, plus we'll get the bonus. We really made the right decision by joining the Lost. All right, Panchos, you're a dick. You sure talk a big game for a janitor, Panchos. Let's see if you can back it up. You're not the Overlord anymore. Just bring it. Red Magnus is going to take your new gumption, shine it up, turn it sideways, and stick it straight up your candy ass. Jesus. We have to discuss this right now. Red Magnus has completely lost it. He can't make any rational decisions. We gotta help him. All right, let's take these guys on. I'll show you what a real fighter looks like. What's the turn over world effect here? No? Okay. I can't hop that, so I guess I gotta go this way. 
wanted to take the easy way, but I guess not. I love all you guys. I'm actually curious. Oh! I keep doing this. Every time I go to record, it's just after I do a long training session. Let, let me put this back. Alright, all these defaults, please. Thank you. Yep, yep, yep. We're all good? Okay. Oh, man. That could have been embarrassing. What is this, like four like episodes in a row now? But I have to do this? It's just terrible. Alright. Let's try that again. Scorching Flame. I was I was all hype. I was ready to go. And I would have just gotten my butt handed to me. Let's skip that. Let's try this again. Let's see what level you are now this time. 46. Okay. So they're, they're kind of hefty. Got a little beef to them. Um, it's a bit overkill using these two. But why not? Overkill is the name of the game. Actually, no, it's just called Sky of Five Complete. Alright, I'm gonna throw you up head. There we go. I need to give her some levels and some EXP. Or they're just gonna throw them back this way. Okay, fine. Ow. Jerk. Take the pound, boy. Ooh, ooh, Magnus. That's the case. Um, are you? I know you're in the staff section. Off bar. Here we go. Gonna heal. Oh, do I still have the special effects speed up? Sped up? Mm, medium, medium. Auto scroll text. Blah 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 blah. That's why all effects are off. Let's fix that. Alright, I wanna try... Not that move. I wanna try that move, but I can't do it right now. Let's hit you with the Wild Crescent, which is easily one of the coolest looking axe moves in the game. Could you not kill Red Magnus, though? I wanna see what this move does. Silver Slugger. My right hand! Oh, I just throw you out of here? Oh, oh, bust out the nail bat. It's a grand slam, boys! <laughs> I love how the bat just flew off screen. <laughs> oh, that's priceless. All right, let's put you up there. Let me take Vakona there. Yep, I named her Vakona. You know. I'm keeping Ralts with us in spirit, guys. Let's see. Let's see. What am I going to do with you? A skill that lets you attack twice. Do I attack you twice or do I actually just attack twice? How are you doing on health? Yikes. Not very good. Magnus, I need you to do a solid here. Just no. If, if I could not be such a fuck. I'm gonna throw you up there. We're gonna heal all of you at once, okay? Okay. With a bigger heal though. Yeah, it's a much bigger heal, but can we go even bigger? Let's run with that. Yikes. Let's 
not do that though. Alright, you, you just gonna be on heal duty today, my friend. Wait a second. Hey. Hey. You put him down. That's rude. Why'd you pick him up? That was rude. I just noticed that he picked him up. I was not paying attention at all. I was like, where'd he go? Did he die? And I'm looking around, I'm like, oh, he's just in the air. Rude dudes. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to fix that. They're just gonna eliminate you two. My right hand! Lightning sword! to pick people up and stuff. I'm gonna have to... Ooh, wait, you don't do enough damage. How? Are you just that... Do you just have that much resistance? You know what? Where's... Where, where's... Where's Eulis? I wanna give her some EXP, too. Because she's gonna be really handy in the, in the late game, too. Stop throwing people at me. Don't you dare. Alright, good. Hurricane Blow, I'll take. Spear gate, that's cute. Killer spin, that's adorable. Get punched in the back. Get punched in the back again. Stop! You're gonna kill yourself. Look, the three of you are just gonna kill yourselves. Get punched. Come on. Let me, let me, let me remind you how it's done. I'm gonna move Ulysses over here. Um, hmm. I have a kind of walk up. Multi attack. So does this give him multi attack? Is that what this does? So it is a support move and it gives that person multi attack. Okay. Good to know. So I can kill him now. Because I'm not having any of that multi attack business on my front. And just a uh, bigger death strike. Goodbye. As for you, my friend, uh, you're going to die here. He dunked him. And have you just lift you and throw you over there. So that you can uh, do some spells and jump. Wow. I definitely need to give you guys some better items though. Alright. I'm probably going to do the whole item management thing after this chapter. Oof. Ooh, nice, nice. Swing again. Get punched. All right, we're gonna do the whole my right hand business. I'm gonna kill you two with a uh, good old phantom blow. Oh, if that doesn't kill you, then excavation will. Or the demon ice fang, I should say. Wow, demon ice fang does a lot more. Jesus. How did that reach? Wait, hold on, hold on. So you were here. Touching me, touching me again. Oh, I could pass. Can I pass the ripple through people that are actually just touching? Deal damage to enemies adjacent to the target. Was it just because they were touching me and that's why they were actually able to do that? Oh, because that's gonna change up the whole game. That's real important now. All right, you coward. A. Hey. Okay, so it was heroic backbreaker. That picks up my people. You coward. Let me go. I'm gonna just have to... Hit you up with a good old move called... Vigor Death Strike. Bring you over there. And introduce you to my good old buddy friendo pal here. Named Dracula. And get you smacked down. Now what sucks is... You're stuck over here again. Alright, come on. Come on, buddy. Oh my god. Alright, I'm taking you out, buddy. What are you what are you weak to? Wind? Okay. Killer storm. Ooh, just barely alive. Oh, that little 
It's real cool. And real painful. Really, really painful. Jesus. I got dunked on. Come on. You know what? Pick you up and throw you at Dracula. Dracula, pick up Vakona, throw over here. I want Vakona and her to have a team attack. Let's see if they can do it. 40%? Aw, oh, nope, didn't happen. Alright. Two characters surrendered. Awesome. They escaped. That's the only thing they're good at. You're one to talk. Stop it, sis. I changed. You stop it. I told you not to call me sis. Call me Madam Seraphina. Weren't those guys read Magnus's underlings? Yeah. I see. It's so sad to have to fight your underlings, Flip. Th that's nothing. Red Magnus had to knock his underlings around all the time in the past. Can you explain it to me then? What led them to act like this? Ugh, the Supreme One doesn't know. They probably begged for their lives when the Lost destroyed this netherworld. It's a disgrace for a demon of scorching flame to act like that. They look like they held a lot of malice towards you. Do you have any idea why? As Red Magnus said, he doesn't know. Why don't you ask them directly? He's a helpless musclehead. He doesn't know how to keep his servants in line. He's a failure of an overlord. What did you say, Sarah? Red Magnus dares you to say it again! My, are you going to pick a fight with me now? Sarah, there is Stop. no need to be a jerk. Anyway, Red Magnus, are you sure you can fight your former allies? Of course! They aren't the Supreme One's underlings anymore! So he can super beat all their candy asses! I see. What's with that? What are you trying to say, Kilia? Look, it's fine. If we just ignore them, they'll come to seek us out. We'll simply ask them then. They might not have a choice either. <laughs> Red Magnus doesn't have anything to talk to those jabronis about. All right, lost mag, uh, lost Magnus, <laughs> Red Magnus. Let's fix you. Let's heal up real quick. Oh, great! An event between the two girls and Zerokin. Scorching flame aside, we can't ignore the problems caused by the Lost. I wonder what's happening in Ishalia's homeworld to the bunny right now. I'm worried, Flip. This is all because of Void Dark's evilness. We can't let him get away with doing whatever he wants. No! Void Dark doesn't always give the orders to every small unit. Then it's the Demon General's fault, Flip? No, it's the commanders of those units. If they fail, they'll be executed. That's why the commanders try so hard. That sounds like the Lost. You sure know a lot about your inner workings. Well, yeah. They're full of... They're full of guys who can't help but brag about their evil doings. For example, how they took candy from a baby, or vandalized a neighbor's house saying, The Lost were here. That's so cruel, Plip. I'll never forgive them. There are all sorts of people in the Lost. All right, well, like the lost kind of suck. Let's move on. Dissolving Wasteland. You, Red Magnus. I was getting tired of waiting. Let Red Magnus ask you before he super, super beats the crap out of you. Why did you join the Lost? Whenever Red Magnus asked you for anything, you super gladly helped out! So why? Ah, did you say super gladly? Oh, seriously? Your eyes must just be for sure you don't see anything. What, what did you say? We were tired of your selfishness from the bottoms of our hearts. You were selfish and didn't have any awareness as an overlord. You used violence to crush all of our opinions, and we were sick of it. 
you. Who do you think you're talking to? Oh, see? There you go again. You always just raise your fist and threaten us. I'm surprised you guys took this self-centered overlord in as an ally. I'm so touched. He's gonna make me cry. You are completely right. You know exactly how I feel. S Serafina, isn't this the part where you're supposed to lie and take your ally's side? Red Magnus isn't that type of demon! Don't you dare look down on him, Blitz! Yes, exactly. That's precisely what I'm talking about. Little Usa, you're taking my side? I see. So the reason they joined the Lost was because of the malicious feelings they developed thanks to Red Magnus's selfishness. Malicious feelings? Don't try to rationalize all of this that easily. Do you know what that fool was doing while we were risking our lives to save this netherworld? Taking a nap! A nap! This moron was taking a nap while his netherworld burned to the ground! Red Magnus, the only option you have left to make it up to them is to die, Blitz! Goodbye. I'll never forget you, Blitz. Jesus. Oh, Usa, are you giving up on the Supreme One? It's what you deserve. You have zero qualifications of being an overlord. You are all true demons. Well, it can't be helped. He was taking a nap while his netherworld was being destroyed. Shut your mouth, kid! Jesus, you heard that Magnus? They have joined the Lost because they feared Void Dark. But we're different. We chose to join the Lost. Don't you think it's stupid to protect the Netherworld on behalf of a good-for-nothing overlord? So what do you think, Red Magnus? These are our true feelings. Now do you understand? Listen up, punch slows! Don't go thinking you can run your mouth and just walk on out of here! Red Magnus, it's gonna super kill you! Hey, looks like the fool wants to have some fun. Take all your anger and stress out on him and make him pay for what he's done. Are you jabronis trying to piss Red Magnus off even more than usual? Alright, I'm not going to defend Red Magnus on this one. But at the same time, everyone's kind of being a dick. Why is this no entry? Why? Is there a way to change that? Okay. I change all the reds to blues, but then that's all no entry. And there's no way to get in. This is pretty much a you can't do squat about this. This is you, you get stuck with that. Oh man, so I'd have to toss this onto like here and hit that over there. Oh, okay, forget that. That's too much work. I'll deal with this. We're just gonna have to go with the strongest offense we got. I know this is minus 50% of defense, but you know what? 50% of bordering on infinity is still bordering on infinity. So we're gonna use Satuna here. Swing. Or why I call her Satuna? It's uh, no longer Satuna, it's Altair. Yeah, you, you just keep doing your throw things, boys. Uh, that's adorable, you're actually starting to do some damage. Hey, hey, wait a minute. Watch yourselves. Watch yourselves. Oh, don't get too big now. Phoenix Valor. I don't know what that move does. Let's find out. Oh, sweet mercy? I turned into a phoenix! Oh, that's so cool! 
Oh, that's a really cool move. This gonna be good for farming later. Alright, whatever. Time to destroy some more peeps. Let's use the real Setsuna now. Smack Willy upside the head. Oh, combo attack. Whee! Hit him with the drill. Got him. I'm gonna bust out Ulysses as well. And... Vakona, why not? See if I can get her to get the kill here. Star magic. Bing. Awesome. Alright. More people getting thrown at me. Oh, come on. None of that bulk up garbage. Goodbye. I need those wrestlers to walk up a little closer. Stop throwing people at me. Oh, that yo-yo trip was actually pretty painful. Alright, there we go. Die. Thank you. I can't reach you from here, can I? Actually, I might be able to. If I do... Can I hit you with this? Yes, I can, but I can't kill you. That'll kill you. Let's go. Obtained. And we're gonna end turn. Stop throwing people at me. I gotta actually t make effort to kill these guys. Dunk. Bye. Dunk. Goodbye. Stand there. I think you walk to me. Or y'all can. Real? Okay. Bye. You're gonna have to walk to me now, buddy. Or you just cower in fear. Uh, that's fine. Cower in fear. Goodbye. Ooh, two more characters have surrendered. Nice. Magnus, all leaders are plagued with a number of disgruntled underlings. Some more than others. And to handle that in a responsible way is part of being an overlord, don't you think? Shut your mouth, little sea stone! 
Red Magnus won't be satisfied until he lays the crackdown on everyone who's pissing him off! Bonchos! Red Magnus is gonna find your candy ass and kick it all the way down Piss Me Off Boulevard! I love how the red flame thing in the background was just happens to be right over his head. That monkey so it just makes him look all pissed. About why we came here in the first place. Sir Kilia, you shouldn't bother trying to reason with that muscle head. Let us simply go destroy that magical sphere. The thought of saving him never crossed my mind. But I can't just leave him like that. Just like I was saved in the past. Can I be like Riza Rota? What's wrong, Sir Kilia? I think he might just need someone to meddle with him. Wait! Sir Kilia! Oh, Sir Kilia, you are mine, but you never listen to me. Hey, sis, did Bro say something strange? About meddling? Somebody probably meddled with Kilia in the past, which changed his life around. It must have been Goldion Flip! Believe it or not, I'm betting it was a girl. What? Come on, sis! If even I can't seduce Sir Kilia, why would you think some hussy could grab his attention? Do you Dang. Want to again? Why did Seraphina get so serious all of a sudden, Flip? I'm not sure. The innocent heart of a temptress is most complex indeed. Yes, sir, I keep being salty. Let's Not gonna lie, life. there's nothing in Sarah's character that I like so far. She's funny, yeah, but as a person, she sucks. Anyway, how hot is Scorching Flame? Isalia, you have to use proper UV protection or your face will get all wrinkled. Isalia is okay, Flip. I'm not the age where I have to worry about my skin. My skin is healthy too, but as an innocent girl, you should always be aware of maintaining your beauty. I see, Plip. Is that the secret to becoming a temptress like you, Seraphina? It's more like a prerequisite than a secret. Hmm, that's very purposeful, Plip. It's a bumpy road to becoming a temptress. Whoa! <laughs> that's a great attitude for observing me. You'll become famous in the future. However, it is impossible to surpass me. In this world, there are some walls you will never scale. Walls that I can never scale? Plip? I have my Baylor gaze. Any man will become mine in an instant. That is depressing, Plip. I guess I can't pattern myself after you. You... Where did you come from? I thought I could learn the secret of how to make a handsome pretty mine, but it seems like that was a waste, Plip. Don't give up, Plip. We'll become temptresses together. There are a lot of things I want to ask, but... A handsome printy? Do they really exist? Uh, that's a that's a question Where that I like never thought it? anyone would ever ask. Just printy in a tuxedo suit, senseless lava flow. said to calm down while you're rampaging around that magical spear is absorbing this netherworld's power at this rate it might already be too late are you okay with that red magnus overlord of scorching flame like sir Kilia said could you refrain from getting us involved with your personal matters can't get a hold of myself. My insides are bubbling up like magma that's about to erupt at any moment. Countless things in life that Red Magnus can't stand. This is one of them that he can't let go. Red Magnus. Red Magnus was really glad that Ponchos and the others were still alive. He thought. 
thought they all died a long time ago. He wanted to beat the snot out of Void Dark, not to become the strongest overlord, but to get revenge for all his underlings that Void Dark killed. But, but, those guys stomped all over Red Magnus's feelings. Yeah, that's right. I can't let them get away with that. Red Magnus. So it's exactly what you were doing Weren't you the one who to them in the first place. What did you say? I'm sure they honored, respected, and trusted you in the beginning. And it seems like you were the one who betrayed their feelings. Uh. Who exactly are you angry at? Your underlings for betraying you? Magnus, looking down won't change anything. Learn from me, and then maybe you can change like I did. Shut your Rudy Boo candy ass mouth! Dude, chill out. Red Magnus didn't do anything wrong. He's not the one who has to change. Man, Red, I I used to thought I, I used to thought you read the, the English. I used to think you were a cool character, but now you're just acting like a dick. Like you're not accepting that you're in the wrong here, buddy. This better be some good character growth after this chapter. And uh, I need character growth for him, and I need character growth for Sarah. We barely know anything about Chris, uh, Christo, Christo, but uh. Christo, I forgot how they pronounce his name, but we've had nothing on his like backstory. Obviously, you know, Christo is like Christ, so this shouldn't. It kind of like foreshadowing that he's an angel, kind of thing. I'm assuming he's from Celestia, but uh, no actual confirmation on that one yet. We're just gonna lift everybody up here. Throw you all this way. One more. And I can't throw you there. I want to, so you could actually destroy these guys. Whatever. My right hand. We'll have to remember that. But yeah, so we obviously got character development for uh Kilia. We already got it for, uh, what's his name, uh, Zerokin, because Zerokin's kind of tied in with Kilius. Star magic. Goodbye. It's so, like we tied those two together, and we, you know, we had their characters develop. Like, Kilius opened up a bit more. We know why he's doing certain things with. Uh, Zerokin, obviously, you know, he's now an overlord, so that's good character development right there. And, like, he's no longer his little cowardly self, either. Can I throw you up there? How am I supposed to get you up there? I need to, like, go up? Is that what I need to do? Can I even throw you up there? Yes, I can. Okay. So that's the plan. We have to go up the castle, I guess. Let's go! Uh, who else is there? Uh, we obviously got, um, like, we're doing Red Magnus' character development now. Yusali, I don't know if she really needs any. Like, we, we barely know her story. We kind of got a little bit, but she, her character hasn't so much changed. It's just we, we, you know, learned about her backstory. Oh, you came down. That, that's fine by me, too. Goodbye. Oh, I guess you're still alive, huh? Um, how am I gonna kill you? Flame Slash? Okay, can't use Flame Slash to kill you yet, but I can do this. That ought to kill you. Go, go. Um. Ah, so I do have a fire move. Okay, 
Goodbye. Good damage with a Hellfire shot. We're gonna put you in the base real quick. Uh, Logan should be up here, actually. Pick you. Pick up Dracula. Throw him up here. Get him in range to help out Kilia. With the Blade Rush. And now we got Dracula with the sword. That's adorable. That's adorable. Stop with this. Kitty Brain Blast? I can't see that. There we go. This is a whole bunch of fighting moves. Oh, Kilia. Oh, boy. You are in a very precarious spot, my friend. I don't want to put you there. I was about to kill you. Alright. Let's just kill you. Alright, now I need... Akbar. Reach kill you? Yes. Can I reach kill you? Technically, yes. That's the best heal I'm gonna give for that for now. Wait, what? Oh. There we go. Alright, here they come. Stop. I'm not having this. Let's use Star. Another Mega Heal. Kelly friggin' needs it. Alright, there we go. Hey. Straight to full. Let's do that. Let's be safe. Fully healed. Counter attack. Awesome. This should kill you. Well, maybe not. I won't die. It hurts. Ow. Mm, you're almost dead, though. Yeah. Nice damage. Hey. You jerk. And now I gotta do this and kill you. Just do me a favor. Die. Well, 
I even have anything to kill you with? Not really, no. Alright, I'll just bop you on the noodle. Yeah, no damage. Thank you for dying. Alright. So it has begun. Oh hey, it's Bloodus. Demon General Bloodus. Red Magnus, the overlord of Scorching Flame, and the rebel army are coming this way. What would you like us to do? What do you want to do? Huh? Before asking me to give you orders. Shouldn't you guys consider what you think you should be doing? Or are you affirming to me that you are incapable of doing anything unless I give you an order to do so? Absolutely not! We'll take care of the rebel army ourselves! We should especially make sure that stupid overlord, Red Magnus, doesn't survive. He definitely deserves to die. Is that a personal grudge? Oh, no. It's because we were his underlings in the past and we Revenge. Buddy. If that is a personal be. grudge. Well, I mean, technically it's not a personal one for just you. It's just personal for Take all of you. Take care of the rebel army. Go claim your revenge. You do know what will happen if you fail. All of your powers will be absorbed, and you'll become space dust. Uh, yes, sir. Understood. Ponchos, you are a coward. Let's All right. Fix you up. Let's heal up. Let's oh wait, there's fries in there. Up. I saw that. What do we got this time? Frog sweat. Hey, Seraphina, sis, come on, let me just touch it a little. What? Uh, what? My, you are persistent. I refuse no matter how many times you ask. Come on, it's not like you're gonna lose it. No means no. If you keep bugging me, then I'll triple your rent. Zoroken, sexual harassment is wrong. You've got it all wrong. I just want to touch this cell phone. Oh, her cell phone. I was about to report you. I was about to report him too. Report me to who? That's right. Don't you have a cell phone too, Krista? My, why don't you let him touch yours? What? No, that's... Please, Krista, I just want them to get download the game and spend a crap ton of in-game money. Is that supposed to convince me? <laughs> Man, the struggle of everyday gamer. Where are you? There you are. Hey, Salia, you know you usually say plip in your lines. Does everyone from Total Bunny do that? Not quite plip. I believe Usalia and my yellow pretty are the only ones who say plip. Is there a reason for that? Nice, bro. You're gonna go there? Reason in particular, Plip. Reason number one, by saying Plip in your lines, you have cuteness appeal, Plip. Reason number two, by saying Plip in your lines, you can express a little rabbity feel, Plip. Reason number three, reason number ten, reason number thirty. With all of these aspects, I can secure my position of mascot character for myself. Oh my god. Y you've calculated all this? Masalia truly is a demon in those aspects. <laughs> Just joking, Plip. I don't know what to believe anymore. Oh my god, Usalia. Where would you like to go, dude? Alright. Let's take care of this last stage for now. Usalia, what are you doing? My, my. I'm surprised a muscle head could have emotional sensitivities. Why would you say something that'll only pour more fuel on the fire? Because I'm a demon! As well as a temptress. <laughs> oh, 
Victoria is cheering you on, Flip. If you hit rock bottom, then the only direction to go is up. Let's change your mindset. That's right, old man Magnus. Feeling down doesn't suit you. I'm heading out now, Red Magnus. While you're stuck here, staring at the ground, Void Dark is absorbing Scorching Flame's energy. Whether you're coming with me or not, I'm gonna free this netherworld from his clutches. Oh, that's what you saw he was doing. She was eating curry. If Bro's leading the way, that means you have to follow him, right? Old man, I know you understand, no matter how insensitive you are. She just made the plate disappear. Uh, awesome. Red Magnus knows what you're doing, you meddlesome jabronis. Fire powder. All right. Oh, those are some upgraded imps I see. They're gremlins now. And we got the axe boys, and more gremlins, and more axe boys, and some thrower boys, and some some uh, samurai people up here in the corner. All right, well, I don't feel like dealing with the hassle of all these people, so we're just gonna go with Dracula. I'm just gonna go sweeping through this as fast as I can. My right hand. Lightning sword. Yeah, Goodbye. Oh, come on. Enough. Good God. You guys just love spamming these spells at me, huh? I got divine booty bumped. Are you for real? Just die, please. Submarine slash. I do not care. To walk this way. Fine. Come on. are getting really low here. It's not good. Ow. Alright, you're dead now. I'll let my stats come back to me. My defense is still lowered, though. Defenses are back to normal. And since you all lined up just so perfectly for me to do this, goodbye. Alright, come on, wrestler boy. Get dunked on. I'll dunk on you too, buddy. I think you're special. You know what? I'm gonna give you the vital steal. I'm gonna take my health back. Thank you. Free heal.
What's wrong? Ever since you talked to Red Magnus, he's been thinking. Who exactly are you angry at? Your underlings for betraying you? I know I'm dumb, but I took a lot of time and thought about why I'm so angry. I super thought about it till smoke started coming out of my ears, but I still couldn't figure it out. I can only figure that this anger is coming from the fact that those guys betrayed me. Is that really the reason? What do you mean? In the Netherworld, betrayal and overthrowings are commonplace. That stuff has always happened. Well, yeah. I've been betrayed a whole bunch of times. And every time, I've punished them for it. So what's got you this time? Haven't you punished your former underlings so many times before? Red Magnus, like me, you're missing heart. Heart? You're very similar to the old me. The old bro was just like Red Magnus? What is he talking about? What are you talking about, Flip? I can't believe any ridiculous story that claims Sir Kilia and this musclehead were ever similar. Believe it or not, it's up to you. Kilia, could you help me a little? What are you trying to do? Huh? I don't feel a single bit of magical power coming from you. I don't want someone like that using me. The weak obey the strong. That's how the netherworlds work. If you can't understand that, then do you want me to give you a demonstration? It's true. I hardly have any powers. Compared to my father and brother, I don't have any skills. But Kilia, who is going to make the dinner you're going to eat tonight? Who washes the clothes you wear? Who cleans the house you live in every day? What? Aren't we family? Family helps and supports one another to live out their lives. We cover each other in the areas that the other lacks, so that we can enjoy our lives, and we deepen our bonds. How foolish. It's only common sense that weak serve the strong. It isn't a bond, it's subordination. You're wrong, Kilia. I don't serve you because I'm weak. It's not even serving at all. We help each other of our own free will. Thinking of others and the love of helping them creates a bond. Love? You're a demon. Are you serious? That's just nonsense propagated by the weak. Power is everything. Might makes right. If you don't take it, someone else will. Betray or be betrayed. That line of thinking is very sad. You must have been through a lot. I'm sorry for not understanding. Hey, what are you? How is it? Are my hands warm? Kilia, your hands are warm. Do you know why? Because you're alive. Because you're alive, your hands are warm. It's the same way with your heart. A cold heart. A loveless heart. That's equivalent to death. You're just playing word games. If I landed a punch on you right now, you would definitely die. Would all that garbage about love and heart protect you from that? Kilia. Red Magnus, I still haven't found the answer to the problem I've been carrying around with me. So I can't tell you what to do. But I want to help as many people who are suffering because of Void Dark as I can. This isn't coming from the side of me that wants revenge. I don't have an answer yet. I could be wrong. But I want to listen to what my heart desires. What will you do? Let Magnus face your heart. I... I... What, what are you doing, Sarah? I figured I'd take the honor of getting rid of the one person you couldn't forgive because your indecisiveness was annoying me. What? If you're trying to get rid of the person I can't forgive, why'd you shoot me? Who is the person that you can't forgive? Place your hand over your heart and think, musclehead. <sighs> I see. So that's what you mean. Thanks, Sarah. Now I finally know what was bothering me. Did you thank me? 
I never imagined a monkey brain muscle head would ever show any gratitude. Sorry for all the trouble, guys. Let's go finish this. It's time to put an end to those guys. All right, look at that. Red Magnus stepping it up. You know what? Let's fix you up. We're, mm, you know what? No, we're gonna save that for the next episode, guys. Where would you like to go? Nah, to let's do it now. I feel I'm in a good mood. I feel like finishing out this this whole chapter growth of Red Magnus in one episode. Let's do it. That's the magical spear. Chill runs down my spine just thinking about how it's sucking up energy. Hmm? Aren't those guys over there Ponchos and the others? Yeah, hold on one second, Captain of the Lost Brigade. Uh, no one told us that we'd have to do this on our own. Aren't you guys gonna fight with us? You're the ones who volunteered to eliminate the rebel army yourselves, right? Y yes, we did, but... Then proceed. Retreating will not be allowed. You have oh, Ponchos, you just goofed. Or live and die. Yeah, but we're up against overlords. To be honest, our strength can't match up against theirs. Purposely avoiding combat is punishable by death. That is your third option. Give up. Whatever choice you make. Sacrificing us from the beginning. Looks like we're arguing. Is this an example of internal strife, Blip? No. The Lost don't consider anyone else to be an ally. They only use others. Most likely, that Poncho's guy probably just found out that they were being used and the Lost have betrayed them. Red Magnus. Gilia, sorry, but can you give me some time to talk to them? Do whatever you want. This is your fight. <laughs> sorry for the trouble. Thanks. Did Red Magnus just apologize? Thanks, Gilia, too, Blip. That monkey finally learned some manners. Is it a sign of some extraordinary supernatural phenomenon? Look at this! No, Red Magnus growing thing. up! Yes, that must be it. <laughs> hey, Alright, Sarah, I need you to grow up. Like Stop being a spoiled rock. princess. What happened? You look pretty pathetic. Shut up! It's your fault that I'm in this situation. Yeah, that's true. You're right. Like you said, it's all my fault. Huh? What are you saying? Ponchos, listen. The Supreme One finally understands why he was so angry this whole time. The Supreme One... No. I... I was angry at myself. For not being able to save Scorching Flame. For sleeping through the battle. Not protecting my underlings. Me, me, me. Yes, I couldn't forgive myself. Why didn't I notice that earlier? No, I didn't even try to realize it. It's because I'm pathetic and my heart is weak. What? Are you really Red Magnus? I'm a guy with a weak heart. Conscious. I only notice that because of you guys. Because you guys are still alive. Everyone, I'm sorry. Because of my weak heart, I caused a lot of trouble for all of you. But please believe in me one last time. I'll protect you guys with every fiber of my being! <laughs> Red Magnus has awoken a new power. Red Magnus' overlord, overlord skull Super Olympia, has become Super Universe. This is my original power. 
power. No, I'm feeling even more power than usual. Do I still become a giant? The growth in Red Magnus's heart has awoken a hidden power within him. This is a miracle. <laughs> Great job, old man Magnus. What are you doing just standing around there? If an ordinary muscle head just became a slightly better muscle head, then show us. Yeah! It's fighting it time. Let's go, you lost jabronis! If you even lay a single hand on Ponchos or the others, I'll burn you guys to ash with my super flames! Hopefully I get revenge mode in this with uh, Red Magnus. Because I want to see what his actual skill is now. Immediate revenge mode. Alright, that's useful. What is your what is your overload do? Okay. Super. Oh. So it's like a on crack version of Super Olympia? It did nothing different. Wait, what does your overload do then? Right. Heart of a leader. Increase stats by units in the same squad by three. Decrease the target defense for super crush. What does your overload do? Super Olympia. Increased stats by 50%. Okay. So maybe that's the part that I was missing before. Alright, so we're gonna just take you. Lift the super giant. But not with you. Logan, there we go. We're gonna toss you right into the middle of things there. What do you mean out of range? Fine. We'll just do that. I always believed that power was everything. That's why I beat up anyone I didn't like to show my power, whether it was an enemy or an underling. It was selfish and did whatever I pleased. I was being cocky. I was the best. That's how overlords were. But it was completely wrong. I don't have any right to be an overlord. I'm such an idiot. Ponchos, everyone, I'm sorry. This time, this time, I'll protect all of you. What up? What up? Super! Alright, well, let's see. I'm not really sure how I'm gonna handle this. Magic change. Ooh, dual magic change. That's a first. So he's got the fist and the gun. Ow. Logan might be in a bit of a pickle. So, I need to kill these guys first. Logan, you can go away now. Uh, Dracula, why don't we back up Red Magnus here? Perfect. Hey, stop that. So, that ought to do it. Alright, and just to finish these nerds off. Nice. Alright, and Magnus, this is your last turn as a giant. Take the Heartbreaker, take the win, the armor break. Oh, that's gonna suck. Oh, and there's this break? Oh, God. Alright, um, the 
bust out a healer here. Can I reach with Mega Heal? Yes. There we go. Nice HP regain. up with the nice brush here. Boulder crush again. Oh, there he goes. Alright, he's in revenge mode, so perfect. Let me just put you right here real quick. I'm just gonna delete like half of them here. Let's see, we're gonna go with ending the turn here. We're just gonna let Dracula finish it off. Adorable, that's adorable, that's absolutely adorable. You should get countered and punched. Alright. I can kill the three of you in one move. Goodbye. Yes, I have surpassed you. Freaking lost nerds. Dunk done. And stage is clear. Two more characters have surrendered. I'm sorry, we... Idiots! I'm the one who should be apologizing. I'm really sorry. I didn't deserve to be called Overlord, let alone the strongest Overlord. Damn it! I'm so embarrassed of my former self! I just want to beat the crap out of him! Are you seriously Red Magnus? I don't know how to explain it. Because of the sudden change, I feel like I'm in a dream. I'm surprised too. <laughs> See you guys. Live long lives. Wait a minute, Master. Uh, please, take us with you. If it's the new you, no. We'll follow Master Red Magnus, the scorching storm overlord, wherever he goes. Oh. Buddy, a scorching Rebel flame, not scorching form, storm. Very well. I'll get the applications. No. You guys aren't capable of handling the combat we're gonna face. I'm sorry. I can't take you guys with me. But, Master... How about you take care of Scorching Flame instead? But we won't give up. We'll be able to help you one day. How about right. taking care of Scorching Flames? Anyway, a power that surpasses an Overlord. It appears there's a very good reason why he held the title of Overlord of Scorching Flame. Red Magnus looks bigger than usual, Fred. Everyone, sorry for worrying you. I'm alright now. I... Not the Supreme One, or Red Magnus. Yeah, I've graduated from using that stuff. Oh, thank God. You really have changed, Red Magnus. Now I can't call you a monkey anymore. I suppose I'll just have to be content with calling you Musclehead. Yeah, when it comes to muscles, leave it to me. I'll defeat Boing Dark and become the super muscular strongest overlord! Good to know you still haven't stopped using Those super at least. Haven't evolved at all, old man. I'm amazed. Are you still trying to become the strongest overlord? Yeah. But getting revenge against Boy Dark isn't my main reason anymore. I want to rebuild Scorching Flame so that my underlings can have a safe place to be rowdy. And this time, I'll be a real overlord for those guys. A real overlord. I'm 
sure you can be one now. But there are some things we have to take care of before that. Destroy the friggin' spear! Alright! This is the perfect opportunity to show off my super new skill! Overload skill! Super Universe! Hello, Bloodus. Has yet to pass. However, it is starting to run out. Historians agree that at this point in time, there wasn't a single entity that could stand up to Demon Emperor Void Dark. The overlords of Roaring Rampant and Brutal Beast lost one after another and their once lauded grander netherworlds fell under the control of the Demon Emperor. With no one able to stop the Demon Emperor, despair started spreading throughout the entire netherworlds. It's almost time for the old netherworld bodybuilding tournament! The favorite, Red Magnus, throws in a couple more sets! But... Suddenly, an assassin takes my beloved muscles! I have taken your biceps, pectorals, and quadriceps. Now, I shall be taking first place. Why is All Might there? I look like a shriveled up eggplant. I have no chance of victory. What should Red Magna do? My former friend, Sorokina, has committed a terrible act. But will that snuff out the Supreme One's dream of becoming number one? Next time on Build Act, Episode 10, wake up my muscles! Everyone stay heated and bulk up! Who is even talking? To all of our innocent viewers, I apologize for showing you something inappropriate. Thanks, Sarah, because I don't even know who is talking. Was that supposed to be Red Magnus and... Zeroken for real? Okay, I don't know. But that brings this episode to a close, guys. I would continue, but I don't also want to get stuck in like another 20 minutes of cutscenes. So I will see you all here next time on Let's Play Disgaea 5 Complete, where we find out what's going on in the next chapter. I have no idea what's going on. So I will see you all next time on Disgaea 5 Complete. The motivational quote for today. Fall seven times, get back up eight. Traditional Japanese proverb, apparently. So, hope to see you all here next time. If you like today's episode, go ahead and get a. Get a blah, 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 blah. I can speak. I promise you. But yeah, if you like today's episode, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, go ahead and give it a thumbs down. Either way, drop a comment in the comment section below. Let me know what you think I could be doing better. And if you have a name that you want to use for one of these characters in the game, Go ahead and give me that name in the comment along with the class. And if I like it, I'll go ahead and throw that character into the game for you. Outside of that, sub uh, you know, subscribe if you haven't already subscribed to my channel before. That way you can uh, keep up to date with all my newest videos and newest content. And I will see you here next time on Let's Play Disguise 5 Complete. So I hope you all have a great day.